Welcome to the EDX 3270 Literacy Education Assignment 1 presentation. This presentation will focus on multimodal literacies and ICTs in today's classroom, looking at how teachers are using multimodal literacies to their advantage, strategies for comprehending literacies in ICT, and demonstrating the place literacies hold across curriculum. As people grow, they are bombarded with multiliteracies in their day-to-day -day activities. In everyday environments, students constantly engage with an array of information and multimedia technologies, which students must create meaning from. Students are using these technologies to communicate in fundamentally different ways than their previous generation. The lives of students today are enveloped with multimedia technologies like never before. Computers, mobiles, the list goes on. Not to mention the endless list of programs, most of which students are more knowledgeable of than their teachers. This is why the digital world is making a swift move into the classroom. In the world of digital games in which students spend most of their time, a light bulb has been switched on in the form of introducing digital games into the literacy curriculum, helping students who traditionally struggle with literacy. The students participate in new digital literacy practices, playing digital games on computers, consoles, handheld devices and mobile phones. Multiliteracies are used to create a better understanding of literacies through ICT, something that is familiar to the student rather than throwing literacies at them, something students who are struggling will see as a negative, and combining the two, taking the negative aspect away so students can engage in literacies in a more comfortable manner, something familiar to their life world. For most students, a multimodal task like this, because it is so second nature, it is important that they comprehend what it is they are doing. Students need to communicate the various new knowledge in a range of different text forms. Using a range of multiliteracy frame plans, a great one to communicate directly to the students is the KWL frame. What the students know, what the students want to know, and what did they learn. There is considerable concern across Australia about low literacy levels, especially amongst Indigenous students. Osborne and Wilson have created a literacy unit to address this problem. At a school in the Torres Strait, the students have created a radio commercial and video collage drama voicing the local issue of type 2 diabetes. The students have incorporated multiple literacies such as dance, drama, props, posters, traditional stories, songs and language, creating a great diverse multimodal literacy unit that is engaging and relevant to their world using language to describe, reflect on, and analyse the work they are doing. When students reflect on their work, they develop an understanding of audience and purpose. Literacy is rooted across curriculum. Each subject has their own set of vocabulary, symbols, and so on, all of which meaning is made from. That, in itself, is using literacy, making sense of the different terminologies in each subject. Understanding the meaning of different symbols in math, in itself, is using literacy. In science, for example, students use the inquiry approach, make sense of text, report and write observations, and interpret information, some of the many ways literacy is used across the curriculum. The following are the 10 annotated references highlighted throughout the overall assignment, unless you have a read of those on your own. And that concludes this presentation. In the description below you will find the full list of references for this presentation.